Proof of concept demo for heterogeneous computing and this design principle that, that Brad and our architects of our APUs are, are driving forward. So to orient you, this is a task manager, guys. I don't know if you've ever opened this before. Uh, yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so, These are the jokes, guys. Yeah. So, <laughs> what you can see here, I'm not sure if, if Chris or, or who booted this up, but you know he kicked in HyperPy here, two instances of HyperPy, calculating Pi out to 32 million instances. So that's why you saw your CPU jump here up to 100%. We're now pegged. So your two x86 Bobcat cores are fully engaged, and yet, it's still Here, working. Using that UVD3 block, we're playing back 1080p video, right? Water skier. It's a good looking jump there. It, and then right here, there. using that GPU compute engine, again, GPU not, graphics does not equal GPU. Graphics equals a GPU workload in AMD's view of the world going forward and increasing this, the software developer's view. So here we are executing the, the in body Microsoft created demo that shows GPU as a, as a parallel compute engine with the gigaflops of compute capability, even in this low power platform, you know, kicking ass on this workload in a way that x86 can't touch. So, three you know, areas, three regions of the chip, heterogeneous processing in action, 100% x86 going to town on Pi, UVD3 block going to town on 1080p, GPU compute engine going to town on a, uh, on a in this case, a physics workload. So this is the kind of thing that shows that headroom. You guys remember I, one of my last, I know your, my slides are seared in your brain at this point. That last thing about the, uh, you know, the forward looking, how the, the, the value proposition for Fusion just keeps giving going forward. This is an example of what developers can tap into. Yeah. And to the point that Brad made, I mean, we're, we're introducing this at a price point where it's going to become uh, easily ubiquitous. It's not going to be a few select guys who can uh, uh, who can afford it. This is this kind of this kind of glass is going to be there uh, for for a great install base for software uh, guys to code to. Yeah. The other thing I like about this demo is it really challenges the assumptions on what multitasking is because it used to be you take frequency, you take number of cores, and you have some guess on how good a multitasker it'll be. But here, the x86 cores are pegged. We're playing a 1080p video cleanly, and we still got room left over to run, you know, the, the physics calculations. An HPC workload. Mm -hmm. yeah. yeah. So it's, it's, it, it, it really does sort of challenge what the assumptions have been about multitasking. That's good stuff.